Yo, just got up. Nothing much. You want to come by and hang? No, you know I don't do that anymore. <laughs> but you still come by and jam. What, 15 minutes? Yeah, I don't like it when people dip out so quick. Give the neighbors the wrong impression. Oh, sorry. We'll catch you later. I didn't see anything. I was asleep as most normal people were. Did you see anyone suspicious in the area yesterday? I did not see anyone. I get up to go to the green this morning, and, and this is what I find. Look at that. But, uh, you know, if I was to suspect anyone at all, anyone in this neighborhood, it, it'd be that mongrel over there. <clears throat> it wasn't like this yesterday. Do you see anyone last night? No. Do you have any leads? Your neighbor, Wallace, he was very eager to let us know that he thought that you were the culprit. I don't know what his problem is, man. I, I didn't break his window. He doesn't know anything. I think we should just write this off as random vandalism and eh, let the insurance companies take care of the damage. But I, I don't have, I mean, I can't afford, it, it, it doesn't cover, you see, I had this collision once and it, like one of the lights was out and they, and, and, uh, uh, um, what I mean is, I think whoever did this should pay for it. If we find something out, we'll let you know, okay? Yeah, I'm on my own. Typical. Hey, Wally, why'd you tell the Bacon Brothers I broke your window? <laughs> well, you seem like the likely suspect, addict. Addict? Uh -huh. What are you talking about? I'm Wallace? talking about all the fucking dope you're always smoking, you know? I spent my lifetime putting scumbags like you away in prison, only to retire and find out that I moved into the biggest stoner since Tommy Chong. Just do me a favor, hippie. Just, 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 just keep your life to yourself, all right? Unless you can prove that you didn't smash the windows, you're guilty in my book. Hey, Wally, weed prohibition is the biggest sham in history. That favorite beer you're swigging, that was illegal in the 20s. Oh, please. The last three presidents, they smoked dope. They didn't get in any trouble. Stop living in the past. Oh, and just look at the state of our country's affairs today. Hey, you know, you're, you're a loser. Just, just, just had it with you. Listen to that guy. Don't listen to you anymore. I'll tell you that right now. I'm going to figure out who did this, Wally, and, and you're going to see it wasn't me. <laughs> What can you tell me about Wallace? Oh, he's lived there a long time. He had a son. I haven't seen him in years. Uh, he used to be one of those special cops, the kind that catch drug dealers. But my children know him better than I do. Can one of them verify that for you? Yeah. <laughs> Have you seen anything suspicious in the area? Sorry, boy, oh, I haven't seen a thing. I'll keep my eye out when I'm on top of the roof, blowing myself. You know, I could see everything from up there. One time I remember I saw you naked. Uh, yeah, uh, I know. Uh, let me know if you see anything else, Ad. No problem, boy. Oh. Um, call me. Don't come by.
United States federal government has spent over $1 trillion enforcing a narcotics ban and creating a battlefield in Mexico, where experts estimate at least 60,000 people have died. The most popular drug among those arrested in this country is marijuana, a plant that has been approved for medical and recreational use in several states despite butting heads against federal policy. While alcohol kills over 75,000 people a year, there has never been a single instance of a marijuana overdose. It's statistics like this that have the United States population calling for a national reform on drug policy. The war on drugs? Apparently an abysmal failure. In other news, the Secretary of State has developed a peace plan for the Middle East. He has decided to give the Arabs what they want most, Israel, and give the Israelis what they want most, Miami Beach. hundred dollars? Uh, how long can I drive my car this way? Seriously? Hey! Where's the hippie? Is that not a pimp shop, you old geek? Well, I gotta get it fixed, but my money's tied up in stocks and bonds and Keo accounts and, and T-bills and treasury and, and herbal futures. Um, Maybe I could work it off? Yeah, we could probably use your help. Hey Curtis, could we use any help? God damn it. Does it look like we need some help? Of course we need some help. Looks like we could use your help. But you know, you're probably gonna get those clothes dirty or something, so we'll have, we'll have Luis drive you home. You can get a change of clothes. I gotta go check something. Wally! Wally? What the fuck happened in here? Wally? <laughs> what the fuck are you doing here? Wally, you get your ass over here! You stay away from me, pothead! Why did I find your golf ball next to my car? Why did I find the shape of your golf club in my windshield? Yeah! Call the cops! It's about time they take him away! Take me away? What the fuck are you talking about? 
damn stupid fucking cops. You know what? They don't believe me when I tell them you're a degenerate dope fiend, a drug dealer. It's okay in this state. Well, it's not fucking okay, all right? Not in this country. Not after what I lost. I'm not a drug dealer, man. Stop swinging that thing at me. I'm just protecting myself, you know? Because you're probably high right now, aren't you, addict? Aren't you, hippie, huh? I bet you're under the influence right now. Well, I smell it. Yeah, but that's none of your business. It doesn't affect me the way you think yeah? it does. Yeah, really? You're crazy, you know that? You're a fucking drunk. Look at you. You break car windows. You bust into people's homes. I'll bet your son has nothing to do with you because you're an alcoholic. I just try to be easy going. My son died in a drug bust, Floyd. My fault. None of you users listen. We were just enforcing the law. I, I was only controlling the situation. You can't control through violence and fear tactics, man. The system is the problem, not the drugs. So now you drink yourself to death because a bunch of old white men decided I'm the criminal for smoking a harmless plant? Come on, Wallace. Let's go. Wait, what about the cars, man? The broken windshield? I was angry, okay? Angry because I, after everything that had happened, everything, everything changed for me. He's still out there enjoying the high life. If I don't press charges, will you at least fix my windshield? Floyd, don't be ridiculous. Sending someone to prison is what he would do. That's not me. We still have to detain him, or at least for tonight. Watch your head, sir. Yeah. <laughs>